Yes. All right, we head over to the Metro here, and I think this one is a clear shot in my mind for Iona mm-hmm. to take over. They have one of the best coaches in college basketball history in the Metro Atlantic. I know you are a huge fan of Metro Atlantic. I'm going to let you take charge here. Iona, with the, we both have Iona taking it here, then Ryder in second, then we start to change it up a little bit. Uh, it hurt me to put Niagara and Kanisha so low, you know, being <laughs> originally from Western New York. However, I know that their teams are just not that great this year. Take me through why you think Iona is a strong chance to win the Metro and your rest of your thoughts here. Well, I mean, well, any team coached by Rick Pitino is going to be is going to be good. It's going to, it's going to be put together well. Say what you will about some of the off court thing with Rick Pitino, he can flat out coach. They have, I think, the depth where they can rotate. You know, eight or nine guys. You know, and they can play meaningful minutes and contribute. And when you're in a conference like the Metro Atlantic you have to have people that you can rotate in quite often. You, you, these, the teams are five or six deep. And then when, if somebody gets in foul trouble or somebody's, you know, uh, getting tired and you bring somebody's off the bench, you, you could lose games that you should probably win uh, on paper coming in. I would have had Manhattan too, but them having fired their coach and now having their best player, leave to go into the transfer portal. Um, we don't know the details of all that yet, but it can't be positive. And I think without their coach and without their star player at Manhattan it is going to be fighting near the bottom. Ryder is interesting. They're really athletic. Uh, they're quick. They're aggressive defensively. You don't think of Ryder as, as a basketball power, not even in the state of New Jersey. Um, but do you think of them as a basketball power? But I think Ryder is going to make things interesting for Patino Ono, but I think it's a worn one horse race in this conference. Um, St. Peter's needs to rebuild. Quack is either going to be really good or really average. So I can see why you would want to put them at three. I had them at five, but really it's Iona's, conference and everybody else just needs to come along for the ride. 